everybody, my name is Phoenix Fur and welcome to another episode of Animal Crossing. Yes, on the last episode, um, we just did a couple of uh, favours with Tom Nook, like doing some planting and everything, and uh, speaking to all the locals. Um, and in this episode, we're going to be doing some more little jobs for him. So hang on a sec. And here we are. Right then, um, in between episodes I have been uh, talking to everyone else and I uh, managed to get a town map from Tom Nook so so yeah we don't have to wander around anymore um, and then we can see where everyone is and I was also given a job to, um, to write a letter to Pinky so I've done that and I delivered it uh, to her house last night so she might get it today but yes, let's see what else he wants us to do. So you're back again today? Very good, yes. Very reliable. Well, let's get to work. Yep, yeah, what do you want me to do? Did you send the letter? Hmm? Good job. It took longer than, than I liked, so I'll have to dock you a bit. Oi! Yeah. Buddy, I went straight there and back, sort of. <sighs> but I'm glad you got it done. After all, if you can't even write a letter, you're going to have problems in this town. So yes, well, I uh, Han actually preferred the next package I need to deliver. Hmm? I'm a bit behind. It would be a waste for you to just hang around here and wait for me. So why don't you go help out the villagers? You may find you could do a little better working for them than you can for me. But not much better, yes? Just be sure to come back here in a bit. So yeah, Tom Nook doesn't have anything to do for us at the minute, so... As he said, we'd speak to villagers, see if they have any jobs they want us to do. And, uh... And yeah, just have a casual thing. Hello. Uh, what was your name again? And what was your voice? Oh, Ali. Cool. Um. Okay, okay. I hear you, gra. And I ask that you please lower your voice in a few decibels. I didn't sleep well last night and I've got a splitting headache like you wouldn't believe, gra. Oh, the horror of it all. Like a sleep, it's arch enemy of beautiful skin, you know. Grrr. By the way, did you need something? Grrr. Uh, do you need a favour? Wow, that's a bit weird. You're always sure I'm just as I'm thinking about you, Skylar. Will you really help me? In that case, can you go to Chow's house and get my camera? Chow borrowed stuff, but they never return it. Beware that scoundrel. So will you do this for me? Sure. That's what I need from you in its entirety. It's in your hands now, grrr. So Chow's house is literally just down there. You couldn't just go grab it yourself. Oh, wow. Although I suppose she's not really a morning person, so. Yeah, where am I going? So yeah, there we are. Oh, ciao! Hello. I forgot that you're a boy. Wow. Hey, Skylar. Your face is looking especially long this morning. What's with you, Aya? Hey, why are you even talking to me, Aya? I'm picking up a package. Here's Ali's camera. I never should have kept it for so long. I bet. I send a letter to apologise to Ali. But can you throw in an extra sorry in for me when you return it? Well, you've been officially asked, are you? She lives right up there. Why can't you just walk, like, a couple of squares upwards? Seriously. Oh dear. Oh, it's you again. Yes, grrr. Well, let's get right to the point. 
I do for you, Grab. Delivery! And I have your camera for you. That's in the form of a shopping bag. Wow, I'm stunned you actually found my camera. Thank you very much. I never thought I'd say this, but I'm so grateful to you, Grah. Oh. You can tell the stationery. You can really tell a lot about people from the stationery, can't you think? Uh, sure. You know, if a serial killer has nice pink fluffy stationery, then people aren't going to think he's a serial killer. Anyway. <laughs> but yes. Yeah, it's pretty much just doing jobs of people like that all around town. Um, Peanut? Oh, hello. I think that might be a new person. New animal. Resident. Yes. Peep. Right then. Oh, hello. You're adorable. Oh, good morning. What could you want from me so early in the morning, slacker? Power shake. Yes. Oh, I see. You're another one of my fans, aren't you, slacker? It's a chore being so darn popular. Wow, okay. <laughs> ah, well then. Don't worry, I won't tell anyone. Hee <laughs> hee. Oh, what's your name? Skylock, for real? That's an okay name, I guess. I'll let you be my friend, Slacker. Um, thanks, I guess. Wow, alright. Who thought that an adorable squirrel could be so, uh... Well, hmm, yes. I feel fresh as a daisy in the morning, Slacker. Lucky you. Anyway, what's up, Slacker? Stop calling me Slacker. Yes, talk about Tyree. Oh, wow. I have this friend named Chow who's been hanging on my Game Boy forever. Uh, hello. <laughs> I think maybe Chow forgot about it. Maybe none of the hints seem to have worked. I know not that subtle. You don't say. I heard you ask this, but you, can you go talk to Chow and, like, get it back for me, slacker? Okay. If it don't make you be nicer to me. Alrighty then, don't forget now, slacker. Yeah, I'm gonna have to change your catchphrase up, buddy. Eventually, when I can, when I get to know you better. Yeah, in this game, uh, you can change up the catchphrases if an animal gets to know you enough and, um... Well, and when they ask you to, to be honest. All the way down here for Chow. Cause this isn't that bad, cause it's not like he lives just down the road. Why am I so tired in the mornings? Are ya? So then, are ya? Why are you here? I'm picking up again. Oh, whoops. Are you going to take the Game Boy pack back to Peanut? Yes. Well then, here it is. I truly appreciate it, Aya. Chow, are you just hoarding everyone's items? Oh, wow. Well, it'd be kind of easy if you were, because then I could just go back and forth to you. Well, you've officially been asked, Aya. And go all the way back to Peanut. Also, in case you didn't know, in the Animal Crossing world, um... If you shake trees, then sometimes money falls out of them. Uh, which is, hang on. Which will happen to me, and that's how I ended up with uh, 100 bells. Yes. Good morning again, Slacker. Anyway, what's up, Slacker? I'm just going to not say Slacker. Yeah. Delivery for you, Slacker. I've seen this before. If this is my Game Boy. Yeah, you, you asked for it. You literally sent me on an errand to go and get your Game Boy for you. Oh dear. I just knew back in my heart that I'd get it back eventually, but I never thought I'd get it back so soon. Oh, cheers. Let me give you a big old thank you for giving you these clothes. Really? 
Cletus, thank you so much. I'll be sure to come to you when I want things done right, Slacker. Thanks. Now, V, if you say you have something that you want to get from Peanut now, <laughs> just wow. Hello, you furry usual morning pet pal. Men, if any, have one. Iota of your pizzazz. Oh, I thought that said pizza for a second then. I was like, what? So what do you need, pal? Let me help. Can't work for me. I don't have time to do any. I'll work for you. Oh. Oh, well, that's a different story. Yeah, there is one thing. Turn this comic book to Ali's house, okay? That's it, pal. That go for Ali came over for a visit and then totally forgot it. Duh. What an airhead, huh? So will you help me out, pal? I'll do it myself, but I've got a lot on my plate right now. Right. Well, that about sums it up. I'm counting on you, pal. Okay, what are you doing? Not much. Okay. And back and forth to Ali's house. I can't wait till I start fishing in this game. And earning a lot of bells and st Oh, hi. Hello. Oh, it's you again. Yes, growl. By the by, did you need something growl? Delivery. And here is your... I'm saying that I forgot something. Ridiculous. Wait, that's, that's my comic book, growl. Could it possibly be? Oh, I see. I left it at Pierlo's house. I'm so horribly embarrassed. I apologise for the trouble that you've been put through, Grau. Truly, I wasn't sure I would give you this to you. The trouble had a close sound. Someone as questionable as fashion says that you could do it. Oi! I'm wearing my shop uniform! Even though it is kind of adorable and I might change the colours to black and red. Maybe. I don't know, we'll see. But yeah, that's... Uh, that's Ali, so... Oh, hello. Wait. Ali, ciao. Bessie and... Bessie, Hank and Pinky. Alright then, cool. Yep. Uh, I need to go. Now I'm just going to cut it here, folks, until I get to Bessie. to you. I was thinking that it was time you showed up at my door. By any chance were you a bit worried about or me, QB? What? You weren't? Jeepers. So what's going on, QB? Need any help? Actually, Bessie still had them into my sweet camera and I totally need it back. Didn't you hate it when someone's borrowed something of yours but never returns it, QB? Yes. It really steams my broccoli. <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay, that's adorable. Yes, I will help you out, Pinky Boopy. You are adorable. And you're one of my favourite colours. And Bessie would be... Over there. Okay, cool. Uh, it shouldn't take me too long, so... Over the bridge, then just that way. Right then. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. By the way, guys, the girls, um, I have some kind of good news for you all. Uh, my Pokemon Gold game is uh, fixed. It's fixed up now, so I will be able to bring you back, ep bring back episodes of that really, really soon. Which is amazing. <laughs> yeah, I can't wait to play on it again and I miss it. And hello. Good morning. Gee, can I talk to you first thing in the morning? This must be my lucky day, Buttercup. I wonder if my day stand out this blessed what could possibly in store for me later on. Oh, that's adorable, thank you. By the way, sorry if I keep on saying adorable. So tell me, Scarlet. What do you want, Buttercup? I'll pick it up from you. Okay, here's Pinky's camera. I didn't mean to keep it for so long. Please 
say goodbye to Pinky before I get in trouble, Buttercup. Well then, please do your best, Buttercup. Thank you, and you are... Also, everyone seems to be wearing the same t-shirt this morning. Even Chow. Um, so yeah, I'm guessing that that pink stripy outfit is kind of popular. It's in at the moment. Nope, not that way. Wow. Yep, see now, I'm getting lost already. Oh dear me. Although it is like, what time is it? What actual time is it? Uh, it is. 9.30 in the morning, okay. That might be why. I is a little bit tired. And go back to here. Also, yeah, do another thing that I didn't explain to you. If you just stop moving, then you could see the time <laughs> and the date and everything. So yeah, and yes, our clock is accurate to the minute and the um, day. Good morning. Hey, did you want something or what? QB. Delivery. And here's your camera for you. Hey, you got my camera back, sweet. If I known I was getting it back, I wouldn't. I was going to be, was going to be this easy. I'd have gotten it myself, could be. Isn't this outfit totally cute, QB? Is it that pink one that you're wearing? So when you say you're going to do something, you get right out and do it. And I'm glad to know that. All right then. Um, I think that might be everybody. Uh, oh, no, 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 it isn't everybody. I missed out my favorite green chicken, which is a sentence I never actually saw that I would hear myself say. <laughs> wow. No, no, Officer Copper. Even though I like the pun, but no. Oh, Hank. You fabulous weed. You fabulous chicken, you. Hello. Hey, good morning. Whoops, Skyler, you're an early riser, aren't you? Yeah, but fuck. I'll let you in on something. I have to hatch. Don't. I have a hunch something good's gonna happen today. Boy, that's a good feeling. Give me a. Oh, yeah. Whoop. Tell me, Skylar, what's new? Need anything? Hmm, I can't think of anything. If something pops up, I'll be sure to let you know. Okay, cool. I just want to chat with you because you're so awesome. Yo. Hey, sir, what can I do for you, Skylar? Give me a job. Hmm, I can't think of anything. If something pops up, I'll show you. Man, I didn't mean to click on give me a job. Just entertain me. Hey, you want me to give a present on your birthday? Okay. I knew it, yes. I mean, that's what I want too. Well, since my dog is fixing presents, why don't you tell me your birthday? Yes, now this is an actual thing in Animal Crossing. Um, animals will actually give you presents on your birthday and they will come round to your house. The 4th of April. Hey, let me just zodiac sign is Aries. Yep. But if I forget, don't flip out, Bubuk. I'll try not to, Hank. You are so cool. You're one of my favourite Animal Crossing characters, if not my favourite. But of course, there is another, um, another resident that, uh, <coughs> bless me, ow, that is uh, quite funky with me. But he only appears on a Saturday. Where am I going? My sense of direction is terrible, as you can tell. Well, it is in this game, at least. At least until I play it often enough, and then I just need to. Huh, that's where I need to go. And so just. Uh, da, 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 uh, yes. And up. Now we talk to uh, Tom Nook and see what else he wants us to do. 
And yeah, I was thinking about making this episode slightly longer because I haven't been on it in, I think, about two weeks. But hey, it'll be good. I've been doing a lot of thief recently. Were you able to help anybody out? <laughs> Many animals need things. <laughs> Did you get anything good in return? The critters in town are all fairly generous, so your work can never goes unrewarded. That's quite nice, yes? Next, I need you to deliver a nice carpet for me, yes? And don't dilly-dally along the way. <laughs> Take this carpet to Piero, yes? Yep. Just because I'm not watching you doesn't mean you can stop and chit chat with folks you're meeting along the way. Then again, there's no me. I could keep tabs on you. Just try not to grab too much. Tell me when you're done. Okay, cool. I think that this might be one of the last jobs we're doing for Tom Nook. Um, and then I think it's like this delivery, maybe writing something on the bulletin board, board and then maybe um, letting us go. If I remember correctly, because yeah, I haven't played this in a while. Oh god, sorry buddy. Morning, pal. Yeah, so what did you need me for, pal? Delivery for you. And here is a nice rug. Carpet. Whatever. I can't believe it's finally here. Am I dreaming? It feels like I've been waiting so long, pal. Let me ask you something. When you think of interior design, what's the first thing you think of furniture, right? Right. But carpeting and wallpaper are important parts of decoration too. It's all connected. Hey, that gives me an idea. Want a new rug for your pad, Skylar? How about it? You can have my old one. I don't want to trash it and it doesn't have too much wear on it, pal. If you just give me the rug that I just gave you. Hey, don't laugh, man. Finding that rug was no joke. I must have checked the store for it a thousand times. See, if you want rare items, you have to be patient. You better check your store daily, pal. Sometimes it's tough to motivate, but it's worth it. Tom pretty much changes his stock every single day. If you don't buy something the first time he has it, who knows when it might be in again, you know? Yeah, I've, I've had that feeling at a game store before, when it used to be here. Anyway, now we've got to find a wallpaper to match. Looks like it's back to the store for me, pal. Yes, so, um, I'll now go back up to Tom Nook, and then we shall maybe end this episode here. Because my iPad, um, decided to dip on me a little bit. Hello. Welcome back, dear employee. Very good, yes. It looks like you finally get to the hang of things around here. The way you work, I'd be happy to have you working here full time. Wouldn't that be a treat? Hmm? Uh, maybe. In any case, I can see you're putting a lot of your effort into your works. So this time, I'll give you 580 bells. Wow. Next, I need you to deliver an axe for Pinky. Be extra careful with it, okay? Careful, wow. I said the light in your eyes. Now the stuff you deliver is wrapped so you couldn't use it even if you wanted to. So don't get any ideas. Hmm. If you want if you want to cut down any trees, you'll have to get your own axe, yes. Very good then. Give it your best shot. And tell me when you're done, yes? So yeah, now we have to deliver an axe to Pinky. Okay then. Yeah, I think we're gonna end this episode here. Um for now guys and girls. If you enjoyed it, please be sure to leave a like, comment, and if you're new, even subscribe. That would be amazing. And yeah, until next time, have a good one. Bye.